unique way for to for handling this type of stuff than other than notification or like dispute the claim but both of those like I'll include um sending my information to the person that uh, that uh filled the copyright claim or like take down request which which i don't know i'll just not have that video on so yeah RIP to over 4,000 views then but like again I don't care this is like just a projection of your own like of your own delusional brain like thinking that this would ever stop me like that is completely incorrect I will stop at nothing even if you erase my channel out of existence like I will stop at nothing to achieve what I always wanted to achieve I'll it'll take if it takes me a million YouTube accounts if it takes me a million a million virtual machines a billion attempts a trillion videos I don't care I'll get there and you are not relevant I will not I will not even name you I will not give you any attention in fact you're just another person another person out there thinking you can just ruin someone's life just like that like if you're just going to f file fake strikes you're gonna get karma back because I'm pretty sure that if that was actual Komodo slash Exidium filing the strikes, then the, the it would be the actual company behind it, which would also show on my YouTube um, YouTube uh, creator page or uh, YouTube Studio, but it didn't because it was just a full name, probably an a alias and um, uh, probably a throwaway Gmail account, and YouTube decided to delete that video. Or was it automated? I'm not sure. YouTube decided.